Hello guys, we come back with story time while painting fruits in my sketchbook. The title of the story is The Reflections. Once a dog ran into a museum filled with mirrors. The museum was very unique. The walls, the ceiling, the doors, and even the flowers were made of mirrors. Seeing his reflections, the dog froze in surprise in the middle of the hall. He could see a whole pack of dogs surrounding him from all sides, from above and below. The dog bared his teeth and barked. All the reflections responded to it in the same way. Frightened, the dog barked frantically. The dog's reflections imitated the dog and increased it many times. The dog barked even harder, but the echo was magnified. The dog tossed from one side to another while his reflections also tossed around snapping their teeth. The next morning, the museum security guards found the miserable, lifeless dog, surrounded by thousands of reflections of the lifeless dog too. There was nobody to harm the dog. The dog died by fighting with his own reflections. The moral that we could get from this story is that the world doesn't bring good or evil on its own. Everything that is happening around us is the reflections of our own thoughts, feelings, wishes, and actions. The world is a big mirror, so let's strike a good pose. Zig Ziglar once said, What you send out comes back, what you sow, you reap. What you give, you get. What you see in others, exists in you. Well, this always happens to people who always accuse other person. Did I met this kind of people? Yes, of course. It's always when you are busy with yourself, someone accuses not because you do it, but because you do it in their thoughts. Because why? They are that kind of person, so how to overcome is by applying silent is gold. Believe that time will show the clear story. Okay, I think that's all for the story time today and this is the result of my painting. See you on the next story time. Goodbye.